light our darkest hour. Hey everyone, hope you all have been doing very well. I know we got this year off to a rough start, but let's forget that for a few minutes. Because look at this art. Do you see the Decepticon ship, the Nemesis? It's not in the ocean, it looks like it crashed into the side of a mountain too. <clears throat> so, um, yeah. There's Megatron slash Galvatron. We got freaking Scorponok, Rhinox. I mean, just like, oh my gosh, look at everyone on this freaking art. Uh, like, I'm flipping out. This is my first Kingdom toy, if you haven't noticed. Now, here's the thing 32 steps, oh my gosh. Um, obviously, it's 32 steps because you could, you know, it, th this thing is great. Okay, so. I'm going to warn you right here that this isn't a full review. This is just kind of me showing you a close-up just in case you haven't got this guy yet. Because, now this is what I want to do with this. I cannot make a single, I will not, I can't, it's impossible for me to make a singular video um, of this thing. Because there's so much, like ever since I've seen these things, there's just been so much that I want to do with these bots <clears throat> excuse me <clears throat> um so i always say with certain robots oh look i didn't, didn't notice that eye that old beast wars eye that's cool um with certain bots i always say oh i want an army build or i will and i never cost money <laughs> so here's the thing with these skeleton dinosaurs like all of these holy crap i need to get like a fleet of them because that's the coolest thing ever like holy cow i have plans for these skeleton dinosaurs that involve dead optimus prime sleep mode optimus prime um what was it dead prowl or whoever coming out with uh blue streak or whoever rusty one and then the Black Ironhide, which is like a drone, a Quintesson drone, spoiler alert. I haven't watched the show, um, but that's what I, I have been told. Um, not been told, read. Anyway, so let's get into this card first. As you can see, the card is Black Arachnia. It is not a character card of the toy. They are randomizing these collector cards, and uh, one of my friends showed me some of the ones he got, and it looks like it is randomized, and they're like hard plastic too, so they're they're not cheap at all. Um, so I don't know if they're trying to encourage people to trade or or what's going on. I'm sure they are, or you know, hey, you know, you got three black arachnias in your army building. I know you said you're done at the 20th skeleton dinosaur, but you do need that one card to complete your whole set. Might want to try to get another one. I don't know. That's my thinking because Hasbro knows. Hasbro knows. After the beginning of Siege, I feel like how a lot of people start, stopped buying from them, including myself. I feel like they're like, okay, people are sick of it. We rose the price by like five bucks. Let's, let's see what we could do. So, um, they started to improve after, I want to say, Wave 2 or 3 of Siege, and then Earthrise was a treat, and now Kingdom is a freaking snack. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, holy cow, this thing is just beautiful in person. I can't explain it. Like, I'm going to post this video, and then the next video is going to be me, like, I'll, I'll do the transformations and stuff like that, but I'm going to probably get like 10 different robots and make different skeletal armors and weapons and all that cool stuff. I mean, just look at the detail on this. Oh my gosh, this is like so cool. So, of course, like every one of us, we were all dinosaur fans. We all wanted to be paleontologists when we were kids, right? I wouldn't mind doing so. Um, you just need a lot of schooling for it. Um, and I'm already going to school for what I want to do. So, otherwise... Um, paleontology be fun but this mix is the, my two childhood loves paleontology and robots and now when my older person older person, gosh, my grown up self love um, it's um, dead things scary dead things anyways that was the whole video here is a stagnant picture because I'm still talking keep an eye out for more um to come and i know you guys have already seen 
all these reviews on the other guys' uh, channels. So I appreciate you guys stopping on by and stuff like that. Um, FYI, I will be flooding my channel with like little snippets, just unboxings. And then as those are published, I'll be editing the actual review. FYI, so I, I, I'm sorry if your notification box gets uh, flooded with a whole bunch of videos that you might not want to watch but i kind of want to make the youtube algorithm work for me because i really need to talk transformers and i have no one right now to talk to transformers about so that's the thing anyways i'm gonna go thank you for watching and i'll catch you guys later bye